story a little bit as it's reflected here. So coming down, it all started from this place, the oasis, the little treed place down by the campsite. When I came here, there was nothing here, except for these trees that had some newly sprouted leaves. And that was the inspiration that unfolded to a story. My name is Peter, and uh, I wish to welcome you all to Sandar Sudursins, which is the name of this project. This project is a what has come to be a post-apocalyptically themed steampunkish permacultural <laughs> inspired um, experimental ground for the creation and facilitation of an alternative community. The main focus is helping people connect with nature. That's number one, two and three. Uh, how we're doing that is a few different methods. Mostly we're going to be setting up this place as a land center. Uh, and that means that we will be showing how permaculture works. Uh, and that will be focused in the beginning area. The base camp, that area will, will enter into that. And we also want to develop into being a teaching center. So the schools and the kindergartens can send their uh, young ones and study here. And re like go not just learn about nature, but be in it interact with it, have fun with it. The plan is for the whole area from the Thorlosat, the town here, all the way to Thringslin, the, the mountain over there, uh, to become forests. And we are part of that project. They're having a little bit of trouble getting funded, but, but I have hope for them. Uh, and if not, then we just have a bigger task on our hands. So it, that's the, the National Forestry uh, Association uh, and the erosion control. And so, so it's, it's the big players that are, are want to play on this land and they're super happy having us here. This is an experiment of introducing the human being and our activity to a very primitive landscape, very primitive ecosystem, and finding, at least making a good, honest attempt on finding a way to live, work, and grow together in harmony. We're also playing around with the five R's of permaculture. Um, so most of the materials here, and I can say quite honestly that at least 98% of everything that we've used is recycled, is found, salvaged, plundered, pillaged, traded, gifted in some way or another. Uh, this has been pretty much entirely voluntarily run, so all of this has come from nothing, essentially. And this place could look like any place here with a lot of junk on it, which there are too many places like this in Iceland. We just here have focused the usage of this junk, see it rather as resources. One man's trash and another man's treasure. And uh, by applying the skills and knowledge that we can amass in our group, this has been created. I have um, drawn up a little plan, which is simply my vision um, up until the point of drawing. This much has changed since a week ago or 10 days. So moving through, through the landscape and these different pockets that now have become the playground, the musical installment, the Viking community, and um, let's see what else pops up. Um, to the more hybrid spaces, um, which are intended for the usage of participants here, people here, um, but also hosting these workshops and just a bit of shelter. Behind the kitchen, 
on this side there are trees planted and uh, also in here in the middle uh, some just over there and by the entrance we actually did the, the first planting on the first day today six weeks ago And plug in the phone or whatever. Uh, musical instruments. Things have found their places around here. Um, firewood happening. Uh, maybe, you know, it's an open space. So we're just going to pass uh, talking, possibly cup, since we're in the kitchen. And then you can just share whatever you feel like sharing, if you do feel like sharing anything. Uh, it can be about how you came here, what is happening here, how you feel about it. The plans change as fast as our resources do. And our resources change almost every single day. But I think it's very worthy of noting, because we change the plan every single time that we get a new resource, then the whole plan is up for grabs. So that's also why we want to get input from you guys. Like, what do you see? What would be the possibilities? There's no point in complaining If it's me and raining Just go and get an umbrella
all the rage Turn the page away from this strange age of <laughs> Time to engage with rearranging our brains From insane to sane Step out of your cage Worrying about your wage You're the Asian stock exchange Just drain the main vein of the pain Take to the sky 